Hey y'all, it's Brittle Teresa and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be here today. So today what I have for you guys is my luxury purchases that I'm absolutely obsessed with but have yet to actually wear in real life. Y'all, I don't know what's going on. I'm just really not... I, there's really no explanation for this. Um, <laughs> You know, I don't like that for myself, but at the same time, it does happen. There are just some items in certain seasons of your life that you just gravitate towards more than others. So we're just going to get into them. I'm going to show you guys them. We're going to talk about them. By no means do I consider these worst purchases because they're not like on the chopping block. They're not uncomfortable, but I also just... <sighs> let's just get into it the first item are my Hermes chip rice sandals guys they are so fresh and so clean i love them like clean still got stickers at the bottom it's crazy um so i picked these up in paris and i feel like i hustled to get them but um i got these at the end of summer honestly getting into fall it probably was already technically fall when i got these so basically i really think this had to do with the season change um i'm very much a sandal girl and i will wear them and stretch the wear for them out as like long as possible because that's how much i love sandals but i just getting them during that like transitional season i just was like you know summer's over <laughs> Sandal season is over in my mind and I just did not pick them up and wear them but that's where these are by no means anything wrong obsessed love the color they are so fresh I love that they look like a Burke um so much but like a designer one and yeah I'm looking forward to wearing them this upcoming spring summer season so yeah all right sticking with shoes I think you guys are going to be surprised by these and it is the Chanel loafers again guys still have the stickers at the bottom i did not wear these i don't know what happened there's no real explanation i knew i was taking a risk buying these because i'm really not a loafer girl but i'm obsessed with these and even when i told one of my close friends that i had not worn these she was in complete shock she's like because you bought them i've been fawning over them for months trying to find my size and still can't and i'm like girl i haven't worn them <laughs> Um, again, I think I just need to make a more concerted effort, but yeah, these are not going anywhere. They were so hard to like hunt down. My SA was so wonderful in helping me grab these, but I just have yet to wear them. I'm like, girl. Okay, guys, the next item is my Dior saddlebag. I'm obsessed with this. It's so gorgeous. Um, and I love it so much. I actually have a bag strap that I bought for so I can't even blame it on the bag strap. I did want to get a Samorga like bag organizer to protect the inside because it is suede but there's really no reason I haven't worn this. I think honestly lately I've been kind of in a grab and go mood. This to me seems like not a special occasion per se but like I'm doing something like when I'm just doing quick runs this is not what I think of but I do want to just think about it a little bit more because I want to definitely get my cost per wear it's so easy to wear the color is so neutral it's perfect um and I seen this girl at my favorite coffee shop with one on and I'm just like I love that so much <laughs> and it just was fabulous and I I just need to get with the program like there's really no other thing to say here um but yeah like i don't know we, we we gotta we gotta we gotta we gotta make this work girl we gotta make this work <laughs> another chanel item y'all i don't know i feel like my relationship with chanel is changing a little bit like i used to girl before i really was on here i i was obsessed with chanel I'm, listen i still like it but it's different very different okay here is the item that i have yet to wear it is this they call it a stole but it's basically a blanket scarf i need to wear this y'all this is my favorite like when i found this in paris baby mm, you couldn't tell me anything i love it so much um and i, I guess i just don't really think about it I don't think to grab it and to take it with me places when I have like my coat on I think because it's like put up in its box 
and when I'm like ready to go I keep my coat in like a different closet so they're not like in the same place and I'm not naturally thinking about it I, I really don't have the explanation but I do know one thing when I found this in Paris I felt like such a winner and I still feel like such a winner like for finding this and getting something from a luxury designer that is so like true to my style <laughs> it's, it's it's amazing it's so soft like I keep touching it like oh my gosh I, I don't know I gotta like I think it's a proximity thing because it's not it's not a lack of love thing and it's not an occasion thing like you just to me it's a, it's a scarf you're gonna wear a scarf when you go you just wear it but like it's yeah like I don't know Y'all see the consensus here. I'm gonna just keep saying that I gotta do better, but I gotta do better. <laughs> I really do. That's that, and, and that's all she wrote. <laughs> so the last thing are these Givenchy earrings that I found in London at, um, oh man, what is the market called? Oh, got these and I have yet to wear them for like a full day. Honestly, here's the thing. Clip-on earrings, especially vintage ones, are not always the most comfortable. I actually had to buy some, um, oops, let me just take this off. For these, I actually had to buy these cushions because the metal to metal against my ear was just a little bit too much and very uncomfortable. So most clip-ons, uh, the, their comfort level just varies, you know what I mean? And so for me, because these aren't my most comfortable clip-ons, um, they just they're giving me not all day vibes and that's why I think I haven't really worn them out all right y'all that is everything I have for today leave me a comment if you would love to continue the conversation because y'all know I love chatting Lux with you so if you like this video please make sure to like comment subscribe and hit that bell for notifications each time I upload I'll talk to you later bye